in the network shown below, a steady state is reached with the switch K open. At time t equal to 0 plus, the switch is closed. Determine value of VA of 0 minus and VA of 0 plus. Here we have VA that is node voltage. We are supposed to find VA when t is equal to 0 minus and t equal to 0 plus. It is said that when switch was opened, the circuit has reached steady state. We know that at steady state, inductor acts like short circuit. That is, at steady state, inductor acts like short circuit. Now let me draw the circuit when the switch K is open. So at steady state means at t equal to 0. So here we can see that the switch is open and there was an inductor. Now inductor acts like short circuit. Now assume that the current flowing here is I. Let current through this one is I1. Let current through this one is I2. Now we can see that when switch is open, no current flows in 10 ohm register. Here 10 and 20 are in series, which is in parallel with this 10 ohm. Therefore, let me find the equivalent resistance that is R equivalence is equal to these two are in series that is 10 plus 20. The whole combination is in parallel with 10. That is R equivalence is equal to 30 into 10 divided by 30 plus 10 that is 300 by 40 that is 7.5 ohm. Now let me find the total current. So total current I is equal to V by R equivalence that is 5 divided by 7.5 it gives 0 0.666 amp. Now here we can see that So to find VA of 0 minus, we supposed to find current I1. So current I1 is equal to total current into opposite resistor divided by sum of resistor. That is 20 plus 10 plus 10. That is 40. So I value is 0 0.666 into 10 divided by 40. So solving this, we'll get I1 is equal to 0 0.1666 amps. So now therefore, we can say that VA of 0 minus, that is I1 is equal to 5 minus VA of 0 minus divided by 10. Or we can say that, or we can write it as 10 I1 is equal to 5 minus VA of 0 minus or therefore VA of 0 minus is equal to 5 minus 10 I1 which gives 5 minus 10 into 0 0.1666. So solving this we will get VA of 0 minus is equal to 3.1. 334. So, this is the voltage VA0 minus when the circuit was in steady state. Now, we will find the inductor current when circuit was in steady state. So, inductor current is the current which flows through this inductor. As inductor is short circuited here, the current flowing through this path is IL of 0 minus. So, here we can see that IL of 0 minus is nothing but total current I because same current will flow here which is equal to 0 0.666 amps so this is il of 0 minus that is inductor current when switch was open that is when steady switch is in steady state or at t equal to 0 minus now at t equal to 0 plus the inductor which was shorted now it acts like current source now let me redraw the circuit at t equal to 0 plus at t equal to 0 plus the equivalent
circuit is shown below current source now i have shown the current source here the magnitude of current source is 0.666 because il of 0 plus is equal to il of 0 minus because current through inductor after closing the switch il of 0 plus is same as when before closing the switch so the magnitude of this is 0. Point, we have 666 amps now we'll try to find the voltage at this node at t equal to 0 plus so let me solve this using kirchhoff's current law so let current through this is i1 say this is i2 say this is i3 and this is i4 now applying kcl at the node va so here now let me call it as va of 0 plus so i1 is equal to i2 plus i3 so i1 is nothing but phi minus va of 0 plus divided by 10 is equal to i2 is va of 0 plus divided by 10 plus i3 is let me call this as node vb so i3 will be va of 0 plus minus vb divided by we have 20 so let me simplify this that is 5 by 10 is equal to here we have va of 0 plus by 10 i'll take this on other side it will become plus va of 0 plus divided by 10 plus here we have va of 0 plus by 20 minus vb by 20 so solving this we have 0 0.5 is equal to 0 0.5 2 phi va of 0 plus minus 0 0.05 vb let me call it as equation 1 now apply kcl to node vb apply kcl to node vb that is i4 and i3 are incoming 0.666 is outgoing that is i3 plus i4 is equal to 0 0.666 so i3 is nothing but va va of 0 plus minus vb divided by we have the register 20 plus i4 is phi minus vb that is phi minus vb divided by we have 10 is equal to 0 0.666 so solving this i can get this is 0 0.05 va of 0 plus minus 0 0.05 vb plus we have minus 0 0.1 vb is equal to 0 0.666 I'll take this 5 by 10 is 0.5 on other side. It will become minus 0.5. So simplifying this 0 0.05 VA, VA of 0 plus minus 0 0.15 VB is equal to 1.6. 6 6 call it as equation 2 now solving equation 1 and 2 we get we can use calculator and directly feed the values we get pa of 0 plus is equal to 1.904 volts 
so this is the required result